I really don't know what to think about Blossom. I've never felt a kid yet and she doesn't really look pregnant to me anymore, but she hasn't come back into heat either. So we're waiting for one of those things to happen, I guess. Okay, let me show you around here. See if we can see stuff. It's hard to tell from here, but Bristol's really big. Of course, her and Bliss have four weeks to go. And she's, they're both sizable. So I'm seeing two or three for either one of them. Uh, Bristol's had a single and she's had twins. But she's so big, but she could just have two big babies in there, but we'll see. And then here is uh, Breeze, and she is due in uh, mid-April, and she's, you know, she's got a baby bump. I haven't felt kids. I don't expect to feel babies on her until mid-February or so. And then there's Blossom. She, um, I've not felt kids on her at all. Um, she barely really looks pregnant anymore to me. Now, Brie, the, this one here, with her first pregnancy, she went almost six months, seemed like, before she went back into heat and never kitted. So, um, th that was her first. Uh, di she didn't take, like, she reabsorbed her pregnancy. Um... And so I don't know if that's going on with Blossom or what, or if I really just seriously can't feel kids, or if somehow she might have been impregnated later than I thought, um, even though I, I know when everybody's due dates are, but Blossom has been a, Blossom has been um, my strange one that I can't figure out. See, here's Bliss. She's pretty big, and look at her little udder is getting uttery. And Bristol's is a little bit, but not too much. But uh, Bliss's is really getting uttery. And they're real deep. Her and her mama both are real deep. And here's Bree. And she's not due until mid March. And, um,. She seems to be chocked full again, <laughs> but she, it's pretty typical for her to have triplets. So let me see if I can get anything on Blossom, but, uh, there she is. Like, I, I don't know. I just don't know what to think of this one. I mean, there's a possibility, I guess, that she's got one tiny little kid that I just can't feel but somehow I'm doubting it and if she is gonna kid you know it's gonna be around the same time Brie does and needless to say on Brie I feel babies so I'm gonna see if I can if I can get a feel of Blossom if she'll even be still let's see if I can get a hold of Blossom come on She's on to me. I, I usually have to fi figure out a way to like trick her anyway. Hi, Bree. You'll let me feel, huh? Yeah. But we won't bother you because I felt Bree's babies and she's kitted before and everything. Okay, so she's gonna bother the camera. So let's see if we can get little blossom right here. I got it. 
see her belly doesn't even feel. Okay, be real still just for a minute, little love. anything so I, I don't know I have a feeling we're not getting a baby from her this time like not the same time as those girls are these three here um, if she goes back into heat I'll put her with a boy and if she doesn't I guess she'll kid at some point huh baby okay you can go eat I'll leave you yeah, you don't want me to pester you. Yeah, she doesn't really even look pregnant to me anymore. So I'm, I'm really kind of thinking that she's gonna go back into heat. Um, Breeze is looking, <laughs> Breeze is looking like she's pregnant. She's cute. And everything's looking like it should. And Blossom just doesn't anymore. She just, her figures changed and everything about her that would make me think she was pregnant really doesn't seem very pregnant at all. So, uh, I'm, she's going to have a baby and it'll be this year. I just don't think this first pregnancy is going to finish. I think she's going to um, go back into heat and we're gonna have to start over from her. I brought some um, conversation parts out. Here, come here, you want one? Yes, my girl. Mommy? You want one, baby? You want one gorgeous? Let me see, Breeze is usually um, handleable. Here, baby. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, here, put it right there. It can try it. <laughs> These girls are still at that finicky age where they don't necessarily <laughs> try new things yet. They're just about a year old. BJ loves. You want to try one? <laughs> BJ loves sugar. Hey, baby. Of course. Of course he does. Bristol and Bliss didn't take one either. And they're well past being finicky age, so I don't know. Anyway, oops, I forgot. Do I have any more? I gotta give some to my Samson. My old, old Samson. And I can't even show you because he's a mess. He's, I'm gonna show you. He's such a mess and he's so old, but it's been raining. And even his bed that he stays on got muddy, so he's a mess. And then he gets in the hay feeder and he gets hay in his eyes. And so they get like runny and goopy. When I only feed him the pellets, the hay pellets, he doesn't get like that. It's only when he gets in there and rubs his head in the hay feeder and stuff that he starts getting runny eyes like you know he's allergic to the hay and he doesn't have any teeth left if he has any it's just one or two right down here in the front and um and so he always like schmutzes up his whole face and when it was freezing all that froze on his beard it was awful he was just nasty only a mother could love right 
Anyway, so that's the story. You're updated on the pregnancies. We got four weeks on Bliss in Bristol and like six weeks on Brie and then two and a half months on Breeze. And I really don't know what to expect from Blossom. She, like I said, I do not feel a kid. Her stomach doesn't feel pregnant to me. Usually you can at least find the uterus and I don't feel anything. So um, something's changed. And it's not the first time that's happened to one of my goats. So I'm not surprised. I, but we'll just have to start over when she finally goes back into heat. I'm looking for it. Um, so y'all have a great day. I got a lot of cleaning up to do with all the schmutz and the rain and the mud. And then you saw me try to fall over there. And then um, it's supposed to rain again tomorrow. But I don't think we are going to have rain for an, a week after that. Not really. And then hopefully it'll dry out some because it's, it's slimy. Anyway, I hope you all are having a great day and you have a great week. I'll see you next week. We'll do updates on baby, baby movement.